Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I will set up access to my Outlook mailbox from the desktop client of Outlook 2016. So I'm going to start by starting Outlook 2016. It's the first time I've done that now on this computer. So the first time I do that, I get this dialog, Welcome to Outlook 2016. I'll just click Next on that, and this is the question I get about setting up Outlook to connect to an email account, and that's what I'm trying to show. So yes, I want to do that. I enter my name and my email address like this, and then I enter my password twice. And then I click on Next. As you see, it's looking for the email setting here for the settings, the auto discover settings actually. Sometimes you do need to log in again. And there you see, you should get three check marks there indicating that everything works as it should. Then you just do finish. There you see now it's connected and I can send and receive mail. Now my mailbox is very, very empty, so that's not gonna show anything, but everything should work here. Now, to change this after the fact, I'll go into, you see there, the file tab here, and then account, and there's my account settings, and there you see that it's connected to my KDemo 14 domain there. So account settings, if I go into that, I get the same dialog that I get from the mail icon in the control panel. Let's go through that route also. So let's close down Outlook and show you that route. Um, and I'll go to the control panel. And to find the mail icon there, I'll search for mail. And there you see that I have, if I go into show profiles, I have a profile that was the profile I just set up. It started Outlook 2016 for the first time. If I wanna change the properties for that profile now, I get into this dialog and there are my settings. That's the same dialog that I got from inside Outlook a few seconds ago. Now, one of the most important settings that you can change is this one. I use the cached exchange mode. That's the recommended and default mode. But uh, the, the main option here is how much do you want to keep offline? So the default here is 12 months now, but you can modify that to give, give it more or less. And of course, that will use up more or less space on your computer, depending on how large your mailbox is. You can have some more settings here, but usually you don't need to go into those. All right, so that shows you how to set up your Outlook 2016 to work against your Office 365 mailbox. Thank you for watching this demo.